Hey guys, welcome back to another video today, and today I'll be telling you guys how I was able to get the fidget spinner rims and how some of my friends were able to get it as well. I'll be also be going over how, what it takes to get it and how long it took me to get these rims and everything you need to know about it. So yeah, before we jump right into the video, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe because it really helps me a lot. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump right in. So... When trading first released, I tried to get the checker skin right away, and I was pretty successful of getting it, but then I turned my sights to the fidget spinner rims, and that took me on a pretty big journey, and you might be asking, like, why am I even trying to get it? Well, it's been rumored to be the rarest item in Jailbreak besides either the brick set or the fidget spinner rims. It's been rumored to be the rarest, and obviously, it's pretty cool to own one of them. Now, for people wondering why it's actually so rare, it's because you actually had to obtain them between a small period of time, and that was May 27th, 2017 to June 2nd, 2017. So that was nearly, actually that's like five years ago. So that's a very, very long time ago. And it's not just a long time. It's actually, you have to get it from the vault safe. So you actually had a chance to get it during that, you know, one week period in 2017. And it's also the first item to become limited. So that's how you can tell it's super rare and also super high demand. So my journey started and I'm basically I just went to the trading hub and I put looking for fidget spinner rims and tried to uh, ask around to see if anybody had them. And I kept on doing this. I sat on the trading hub, opened trades and tried to trade for fidget spinner rims if anybody had them. I even asked around on Discord, but people on Discord were looking for pretty big overpays for the fidget spinner rims. So I knew it wasn't the best place to go. But around the same time that I was in the trading hub, you know, sitting there for a few hours, I actually had someone get the fidget spinner rims that I actually knew and they told me exactly how to get it. So the person was real resistance, they're able to get the fidget spinner rims and their advice was to switch servers every three minutes. So stay in a jailbreak server for like, you know, three minutes of trading server and then switch it every three minutes if you can't find someone with a fidget spinner owner. Now I did this strategy for like, you know, another hour or so and yeah, I could not find anyone still with this. Around the same time, I saw even more people get the fidget spinner rims. They told me like, hey, I got it through this way and that way. And that made me want to get the fidget spinner rims even more. And that's when I decided to live stream to see if I can get some trades, you know, while live in front of all of you guys and see what I can do. And that's when someone in the live stream actually decided to give me a trade. Wait, hold up. Let me see. Do anything? Oh! <gasps> Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, guys. He says do anything. Wait, okay, 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 okay. Wait, 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 wait. What do I need to give? Uh, jet. <gasps> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wait, no. Is this gonna work? <gasps> oh my gosh, I actually got it. Oh my gosh. Okay, enjoy them. I got it for the beignet. I am like, I got the finished fitter rims. Oh my goodness. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thanks so much, man. Thanks so much. Oh my goodness. I'm like freaking out right now. Enjoy them, lol. Oh man. Thanks. Thanks so much. <laughs> oh my goodness. So yeah, that was me getting the fidget spinner rims from Danilson. So shout out to Danilson for giving it to me. Thank you so much. And I just want to say that he actually got it for trading the beignet for the fidget spinner rims. So I got to say, like, if I would definitely trade away the beignet for the fidget spinner rims. So he definitely got a W trade right there. And I would have given the beignet if someone offered fidget spinner rims for that. So yeah, anyway, I'm so glad I actually got it. And I think it looks the best on the monster truck because the monster truck actually has the biggest wheels so actually and also you should use i think the chrome color actually looks the best on it oh yeah if you do radiant ice radiant orange or radiant green it actually glows so yeah i think it's kind of obvious but i'm gonna clip chrome because i think it looks nicest on the chrome but yeah, now I'm going to tell you guys how other people actually got their fidget spinner rims. Because, you know, Danilson got it through the beignet. But how about other people? What did they take to get the fidget spinner rims? Let me show you. So this is Fiery Diamond over here. Fiery Diamond is uh, pretty active in the jailbreak community and stuff. And he's actually managed to get the fidget spinner rims. And this is his trade right over here. 
So this is fire rate trade over here, as you can see. So it is actually not just for the fitter spinner rooms. The fitter spinner rooms were offered with part of the trade deal. Over here, he's offering Celsius, Bruley, M12 Molten, Beam Hybrid, Banana Car, Megalodon, and Airtail. And in return for the spinner rims. And obviously, this is a huge overpay just for the fidget spinner rims. If you guys are wondering why all these vehicles are here, it's just to balance it out. The tank, jet, Blackhawk drone, vault, and trailblazer, and vault 4x4. This is definitely a huge overpay because, you know, we got the Bruley, the M12, and the Beam Hybrid. And we also got more limited vehicles. Definitely an overpay for uh, the spinner rims, but, you know, that's what it takes. Another one of my friends actually got the spinner rims. Uh, it's Warlord Dave over here, and this is his trade. He actually made a video. In fact, I feel really bad for Dave because he actually spent like 50 hours looking for uh, the spinner rim. He just went to the trading hub. He was on the Discord server. He was just spamming his trade request, hoping to get it. And finally, after like 50 hours, he finally got it. So as you can see right over here, this is his trade deal over here. Bruley, M12 Molten, Pixel, Spare, Spike, Torero, and Gold. And as you can see over here, because of the jailbreak balance system, look at that. The jailbreak balance system, the spinner owner actually had to uh, give up the monster truck, tank, trailblazer, concept, and jet. And that's like 6.5 million. They had to give up 6.5 million just so it can balance out. So, yeah, I mean, like, the concept car is actually useful now because it uh, can balance stuff out. But, like, you know, they had to give so many million-dollar vehicles just so uh, the spinner could balance out. But uh, Dave had to give a lot of stuff. The Bruley M12, Torero, Pixel, and also Gold as well. And uh, I think right over here is where they accepted the offer. So, yeah, congratulations, Dave, for getting the spinner rims. Dang, man. So yeah, that's what I've been seeing for people getting the fidget spinner rims. They've been giving those a lot of vehicles, a lot of overpay. So I think those last two deals were pretty overpay. But uh, a deal I see really commonly is uh, giving a torpedo for a fidget spinner rims. That's what I've been seeing a lot. So if you have a torpedo, I think you can easily get the fidget spinner rims. Although I do feel it's a bit overpay. But, you know, I guess that's what people are doing. Torpedo for fidget spinner rims. And yeah, I feel really glad for finally owning the rarest thing in the game. So shout out so much to uh, Del Nilsson for giving it to me. Thank you very much. And uh, he got it for getting the beignet. So just uh, keep that in mind. So yeah, let me know what else should I get. I finally got the spinner rims. This is what it looks like in the garage, as you can see right over here. And uh, yeah, tell me what I should get down below. What vehicle or maybe what other uh, spoiler or item should I try to pursue or get next? Let me know down below. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you all next time. Bye!